Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Back After 10 Bar Reviews. I'm Brandon, bringing you a quick review of the Ethos Hybrid. Now, the original Ethos was a ball that I think a lot of people slept on. That ball was amazing. It was the first Brunswick ball that I drilled after coming back to bowling after 10 years. And I was pleasantly surprised with that ball. And I'm so glad that they came out a little late. Brunswick should have came out with it sooner but the Ethos Hybrid. Now I will admit, I've thrown this ball just a little bit simply because we tried a new fit. So I'm gonna give you guys my impressions with the new fit of this ball and we'll go from there. All right, Ethos Hybrid. Oh my goodness. Now mind you guys, I am on a transitioned cow shot. I actually shot the Ivory Rhino Pro video on this same pair. So it is chewed up, out of box surface. Again, simple pinup layout, I'll throw that in the description. But one thing I'm definitely seeing out of this ball, right out the gate, is I'm slightly deeper and the recovery is amazing. got around that one okay now that was on me i got around it got on top of it so the ball checked as it should let's clean up this spare oh missed that one that's okay full transparency i have thrown this ball a little bit not much but simply because of the fact that it's a different fit so those of you who've gone through fit changes whew, you got to make sure it's right this HK22 C additive is, boy, I'm telling you. Mm, got around that one too, but that's okay. Held them. Again, that's, I'm adjusted to the new fit, but the ball saw friction. It did peel off of it like hockey puck in any way, shape, or form. Ball does flare a decent amount. Oh my gosh. I love how this ball sees friction and dives. I love it. Let's throw one more. Like this thing is, ooh wee. All right, let's see, we're standing. 33 with my feet with this shot and we're going to go about 16 17 at the arrows oh boy okay so she saw a little bit of oil didn't freak out not mad at all not mad at that at all. Let's see if we could clean this up. Nope. <laughs> that was in a ditch, and that's okay. Let's throw a couple more shots. Now, one thing I am noticing, which in some cases annoys me, but because of the reaction I'm seeing, I'm not. Lane shine. Shout out to uh, my dude Christian Haywood. He posted the video. If you're not following him, go follow him. You saw my this ball gets a little lane shine. It's a monster. And I'm seeing that. Yeah, man. I mean, this thing just sees friction, peels off of it, still drives. Not once did it puke. And as I got games or frames on it, it just it's just better. I want to say out of box is around 2,000. A little. Ooh, leaked it a little right. Still recovered. Okay. We might have something special here, people. Pick up your spares, kid. Yeah, this is a. Uh, this is one of those balls. I think it could be for house tournament high rev 
low rev. This this man, Brunswick. <laughs> That that shot wraps it up. That, that shot's it. You don't need no more. Let's break it down. Okay, guys, so there you have it. You saw my reaction. You saw the ball reaction to the Ethos Hybrid. I can tell you right now, without a shadow of a doubt, this ball is going into the main bag. This is the ball that's going into the everyday main bag, which means um, one of my six balls it's not going to make it. I'm not saying it's going away, but it's going to be replaced. And it very well could be the GB5. My pinup GB5. I know, I know. I love my GB5. I have two of them, and I love them both. But this is giving me ball motion, even in transition, but I don't have with either one of my GB5s. So, if you want to see a comparison video between my pinup GB5 and the Ethos Hybrid, let's get this video to 20 likes and I'll do a comparison video. Otherwise, Ethos Hybrid available now. Check out your local pro shop. Brunswick, you did a wonderful thing here. I really hope you do it with the GB5, but this is wonderful. Do not sleep on this ball, people. I'm not paid by Brunswick. I'm not sponsored by Brunswick. This is, I've paid for this ball myself. Do not miss a good piece because it's not popular. Trust me, you want this ball in your bag. Shout out to Next Gen Bowlers Pro Shop inside AMF Stardust Lanes here in Grove City. Talk to you guys in the next video.